skip the cutscene. They're like asking the same thing. I was like, oh, I'm sorry. Stop reminding me of my mistake. I was thinking that. Like, stop reminding me of my mistakes. I know. I know I did wrong. What's up, everybody? My name is Lehua, and welcome to the Superfina channel. I am a variety content creator, meaning I cover a variety of things that I'm interested in. And one of those things is Final Fantasy XIV Online. Final Fantasy XIV Online is my first MMO. I really like it to the point that I stream it a lot. Yeah, it looks like I'm. It looks like my Twitch channel is focusing only on Final Fantasy XIV. And if you want to check it out, that is twitch.tv slash Superfina. I stream every Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Saturdays. In this series of videos, I talk about my experiences in Final Fantasy XIV. One of the things I want to talk about is do not skip cutscenes. I made a mistake of skipping a cutscene and I regretted it. I regretted it. I never want to skip a cutscene ever again. I don't normally skip cutscenes. I usually watch them. And these cutscenes, they have voice acting. A lot of the stuff you have to read, but these cutscenes, they have voice acting. Fortunately, I was able to watch it. Final Fantasy XIV has this thing where when you go to an inn, you can watch playbacks of these cutscenes. As long as you finish the quest that that cutscene was in, you can watch it again. Or you can watch what you missed. When people found out that I skipped the cutscene, whoa, bruh, people were like, why did you skip the cutscene? I'm like, I didn't mean to. I did mean to, but I, I thought it was going to be okay. I thought it was going to be okay. I was like, oh my gosh, I look like an ass. I look like I didn't care about this cutscene. I look like I didn't care about these characters, but I do! I do care! <laughs> I really care about the story. What happened was, I was doing the story as one of my classes. I had three classes. I had a black mage, I had a machinist, and a gunbreaker. I was doing the story as a black mage. That's my main class. My first class. My main one. My main one. My baby. And while I was doing the story, I was also doing the Daily roulettes are trials, dungeons, alliance raids. They're things that you can do daily through a roulette, meaning it's going to be random. You don't know what you're going to get. And by doing this, you get bonus experience. With this bonus experience, your class can level up faster. Like really fast. So fast that my black mage was already at level 80. And 80 is the cap. And how did I do that? Daily roulettes. I did daily roulettes for 30 days straight. Bam! My black mage is level 80 already. Yeah, that's what happened. Anyways, 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 anyways. I was doing that for my machinist class. When I was doing the story as my black mage, there was a cutscene. The cutscene happened, and then the pop-up window for the daily roulette came up asking to start it, to join, to withdraw, or to wait. I picked wait. The thing was, it was from a machinist and that was a black mage and it said can't join because you're not the right class that you joined in as. I'm like, oh shit. So I'm trying to get to my menu to change my class, but I couldn't. I was like, fuck. And another fact is, if you withdraw or if you don't confirm doing this daily roulette, you get penalized. And I didn't want to get penalized. I'm like, no, I got penalized already. I had my 30 minute wait thing already. I don't want this to be on my record. I don't want to be known as the person who abandons these things. Like, I did not want to have like a bad record. Like, I was thinking the worst if I get penalized. And I couldn't get out of the cutscene to change my class. The only option I had was to skip the cutscene. And I was thinking, eh, it's okay. I'll skip it. I skipped it. But I was too late to confirm for that daily roulette. So I skipped that cutscene for nothing. 
I was so mad. I was so mad because I like to watch cutscenes. I was so mad. I was like, fuck this. I don't care if I get penalized next time. I already got penalized now. <sighs> I was so mad. I was like, I'm never skipping a cutscene for these daily roulettes again. Never, never, ever, ever. Usually what happens when the daily roulette pops up saying you can join it, you join it. And then the cutscene stops and after the daily roulette, you go back, you can watch the cutscene. Because I was on the wrong class, I couldn't do that. Because I was in the wrong class, for some reason I couldn't get to the menu section to change into the right class. So all that shit happened. All that shit happened. And because I missed that cutscene, the next scene I saw, I was I was confused. I was like, wait, who are these people? What's going on? And it was because it was related to the cutscene I skipped. I was like, no. And the people in my chat, I was streaming this. I was streaming this. The people in my chat, they were like, you don't know who that is? Didn't you watch a cutscene? I'm like, no, didn't you see me skip it? <laughs> I was like, no. And they're like, why did you skip it? I'm like, you saw why I skipped it. You saw. And then there are people who didn't see. They jumped in after I skipped the cutscene. They're like asking the same thing. And I was like, oh, <laughs> I'm sorry. Stop reminding me of my mistake. I was thinking that. Like, stop reminding me of my mistakes. I know. I know I did wrong. <laughs> So I had to finish the quest and then go to an inn and look at the cutscenes. That's what I did. Ever since then, when I'm doing the main story and leveling the class at the same time, I would go to a website that has a list of all the quests to see if there's any cutscenes that's going to come up soon. Because I don't want that shit to happen again. I don't. I don't. So I'm little bit more cautious and more mindful when I do these daily roulettes because I'm so paranoid that's gonna happen again I do not want to miss anything I do not want to be confused I don't want to miss sequences because sometimes I have that obsessive thing where I like to see in chronological order I like to see things you know go boom 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 do that domino effect thing <clears throat> I like that I like seeing domino effects I like seeing chain reactions yeah, so that's my story. Don't skip cutscenes. Don't. Don't. Or else you're going to end up like how I did. Sad. Regretful. <laughs> so regretful. And that's one of my stories about my experiences in Final Fantasy XIV Online. If you like this, don't forget to give this a like. If you didn't care for it, you can give it a thumbs down. Do whatever you like. And if you have anything you want to add to this story, if you had any experiences like this too, you can leave in the comments below. There's also the Discord. I'll have a link in the description below. A lot of people in the community play Final Fantasy XIV and we're also interested in other stuff too. We have a bunch of threads on different subjects. There's a variety of things, you know, variety content creator, variety streamer, variety subjects, Discord. You see, the theme, the pattern here. I also host podcasts across worlds where I talk about anime, manga, and other things I'm interested in. Ah, uh, I know what Yona's like. Yona is like a doll that suddenly develops a life of her own. That's what Yona is like. No, because then we've got Violet Evergarden, which is the exact same thing. A doll that develops a life of her own, but that was good. It made me <laughs> cry. <laughs> <laughs> But remember, Violet Evergarden was developing because with all the people she was meeting. Yeah, you're just meeting new people. And it's not as... <laughs> not as much as an impact. <laughs> oh, gosh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> now you see my problem. <laughs> If you like that stuff, I'll have a link in the description below too. Other than that, my name is Lehua and this was the Supervina channel. 
talking about my experiences in Final Fantasy XIV. And I'll see you on the next video. Laters. Huge thanks to my Patreons and channel members for making this video possible. If you also want to be part of the Superfina party, you can click over here or become a channel member. Don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss the next video. And I do stream live on Twitch every Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Saturdays. Hope to see you guys there and I will see you on the next video. This bump.